Hello everyone. Welcome to the series of Best on IPM. This particular question is from IPMAT 2019 short answer section. If x comma y comma z are positive real numbers such that x raised to 12 is equal to y raised to 16 is equal to z raised to 24 and these three quantities given as are in arithmetic progression then the value of n is. I would want you to pause the video, solve the question and then come for the explanation. Hello everyone. If you like our content and want to experience the IMS pedagogy, then join our zero fee pep program that will give you access to concept videos, sectional test and full length mock test and many more for free. To avail this, please click on the link mentioned under the description box below. Happy learning. Let's see. So I know that this is given to me okay what I can straight away do is I can straight away equate them to k and at the same time I can take I, I can say raised to 1 by 4 for all of them right so basically it would become x raised to 3 is equal to y raised to 4 is equal to z raised to 6 right and now I can equate all of them to k and I know that this three quantity are an arithmetic progression. So we will have to find out the value of each one of them. So here if I have three log x to the base y, I can say this is three into log x upon log y, right? Now. I can get the value of x and y from the above expression. So from here I can say that x is equal to k raised to 1 by 3, y is equal to k raised to 1 by 4 and let us also find out z is nothing but as k raised to 1 upon 6. Correct. So if I substitute the value of x and y here, what will I get? It's 3 into log of k raised to 1 by 3 upon log of k raised to 1 by 4, which will be nothing but as 3 into 1 by 3 log k upon 1 by 4 log k. So, log k gets cancelled out. So, I can say it is 3 upon 1 by 3 upon 1 by 4 and on simplifying I will get this as equal to 4. Now once I have got the value of the first expression, what I, once I have got this value, I can get this value without writing everything. So if I look at 4 log y to the base z, I know that it will be 4 into 1 by 4 upon 1 by 6 and that turns out to be 6 okay and now let us find out the third value which is n log z to the base x this will be n into 1 upon 6 and x is 1 upon 3 so it's 1 upon 3 so on simplifying what do I get? I get this as n by 2. So now I know that this 4, 6 and n by 2 are in arithmetic progression. So I can see that from 4 and 6, I mean the difference is 2. So 6 and n by 2 the difference should again be 2. That means n by 2 should be equal to 8 which gives me n is equal to 16 and that should be the answer. Now I would want you to solve this replica question. Comment in the answers, comment your answer in the comment section and within 24 hours we will comment the correct answer.